Mastering first conditional sentences. Making your English more contextual. Hello, everyone. In today's lesson, we're going to tackle an essential part of English grammar. First conditional sentences. We'll learn about their structure, practice creating them, and most importantly, understand how to use them in context. So, let's dive right in. First things first, what is a first conditional sentence? In English, we use the first conditional to express situations that are likely or possible to happen in the future. It's a combination of two clauses, an if clause, which is the condition, and a mon clause, which is the result. The structure is simple. If clause, if plus present simple. Main clause, will plus infinitive. For example, if it rains, if clause, I will stay at home, main clause. Notice how the if clause presents a possible future situation, and the mon clause gives the result of that condition. Creating first conditional sentences is a breeze once you understand the structure. Remember, our if clause uses the present simple tense, and our main clause uses will plus the infinitive form of the verb. For instance, if I finish my work early, if clause, I will go to the cinema, main clause. Keep in mind that we can also switch the clause's order without changing the meaning. Example. I will go to the cinema if I finish my work early. This flexibility allows for more natural speech patterns and variations in your writing and conversations. Understanding the first conditional in isolation is one thing. Applying it to real-world situations is another. The true mastery lies in using these sentences in context, making your English more fluent and understandable. For instance, consider this situation. You're planning a picnic with your friend. Here's how a first conditional sentence can fit into your conversation. You, if the weather is nice tomorrow, we will have a picnic at the park. This sentence perfectly captures your plan, which is conditional on the weather being nice. Similarly, imagine you're advising a friend who wants to lose weight. You might say, you, if you exercise regularly, you will lose weight faster. In this scenario, the condition is regular exercise, and the result is faster weight loss. Practice creating similar sentences in different contexts to get a strong hold on the first conditional. And there we have it. With this, you should be able to confidently create and use first conditional sentences in your daily conversations and writings. Keep practicing, apply these sentences in different contexts, and you'll master them in no time. Remember, language learning is a journey, and every step you take brings you closer to your goal. So, keep going, and until next time, happy learning!